Have you ever seen a bear hunting sharks or whales before? Polar bears are among the most dangerous wild animals on our planet. It is characterized by intelligence, great ability to survive, and mastery of hunting methods. The terrifying thing is that if bears feel hungry, they can eat any creature they meet on their way. They can even kill and eat their cubs to satisfy their hunger. How do bears kill their cubs without any mercy? Will the bear be able to hunt a huge walrus with sharp fangs? And what can happen if the bear gets into a fight with sharks and whales? All this and more we will know in today's episode. But before we start, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. And let's get started. With the onset of the summer season and the melting of snow, the chances of bears getting any meals are diminished. And that's why they can attack bears or cubs of the same species. In this scene, while this mother bear was walking with her little cub, a male bear attacked them and wanted to eat the little cub. The mother started running with her cub, hoping that they would be able to escape. But unfortunately, the little cub's movement was too slow, and the male bear was able to catch him. Although the mother tried to counteract the attack of the male bear, but at the end, she feared for her life and had to let him eat her son in front of her. This animal is called a walrus. Its length ranges from 2 meters to 4 meters, and its average weight is around 1,000 kilograms. Although the size of the walrus is much larger than the polar bear. However, if the bear is hungry, it will attack the walrus and eat it easily. Walrus always prefers to stay in groups and the bear's penetration of the shield that the group made is not an easy thing at all. Therefore, the bear keeps looking for any gap through which it penetrates the walrus herd shield, and at the right time, the bear attacks any walrus from its back. This is of course because he can't attack him in his face because of his sharp fangs. If you see seals while they are moving in the wild, they can make you laugh. How can she escape with those slow steps from predators, especially polar bears? The seal's movements on land are much slower than their movements in the water. Mostly the bear tries to catch it before it goes down to the water. This is because if the seal flipped and jumped into the water, the possibility of catching it would be much more difficult. When this bear sensed that there is a seal close to him, he found his last chance to get a meal after starving for a long time. So he decided that this time he should focus very much and try to hunt it accurately. Indeed, the bear began swimming and approaching the seal calmly and cautiously. And after he got close to a suitable distance, he attacked the seal with full power. The chase ended underwater with the victory of the bear and the killing of the seal. And the bear came out of the water happy with the meal that will satisfy him for days. As the bears get hungrier and struggle to survive, they could think of climbing mountains and cliffs to hunt guillemots. Although climbing a bear in this way can endanger its life, but he can reach the nests and devour all the eggs in it, and also eat young birds in front of their mothers. The mother birds leave the nest as soon as they see the bear, and they can't do anything to stop the bear from killing the little birds. Over the past 50 years, Water has begun to replace snow in the Arctic significantly. Scientists noticed that sharks and whales began to appear clearly in the Arctic. And currently, sharks and whales share hunting seals with bears. But how can orca whales hunt seals while they are above the ice? As soon as orca whales discover that there are seals available on the ice, the group of orca whales attacks the ice from the bottom and breaks it into tiny pieces. And after the ice piece size that the seal is sitting on becomes smaller, the orca attacks the seal and preys on it without any mercy. But does this mean that whales can enter a fight with polar bears? Polar bears appeared in many scenes while hunting the white whale. At first, the bear jump into the water, kill the whale, take it out to the ice, and eat it easily. Bears know very well that the beluga whale needs to stick its head out of the water to breathe. This is often the right moment that the bear catches the white whale. A huge whale or shark can satisfy at least 20 bears. As soon as they feel that there is a whale or shark about to die, bears attack him immediately, kill him and eat him without any hesitation. They also have no problem eating dead animals. 
What impressed you the most in today's episode? Tell me below in the comments. And do not forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you very soon with a new episode.